What's up guys, it's your boy Zion, and I'm going ahead and bring you another Destiny video. In this one, we're going to be talking about a new change that they've gone ahead and talked about in the Rise of Iron, in that they're bringing back the Yallerhorn, and if you pre-order the Rise of Iron DLC, you basically get a reskinned black and red and gold Yallerhorn. So, really, really cool um, that they're bringing the Yallerhorn back, but it makes me a little sad and skeptical. Um, I say that because... In year one, for you newer players, the Yallerhorn was the end-all be-all and was the only solution to everything. It wasn't go ahead and learn the tactics to how to go ahead and do a raid. It wasn't learn how to use fucking snipers to do stuff. It's you had to have a Yallerhorn or you weren't getting into a group to do a raid or nightfall or any endgame activity. Um, you had to have the Yallerhorn to go ahead and partake in it. And then when you finally got to a boss, it was spam rockets. Heavy synth, spam rocket. Reload, spam rocket. That's all the fucking game was back in year one because of the Yallerhorn. And it, it was sad. It was actually one of those things that divided the community because you had people barring people out of content simply because they didn't get a single drop. So I know I was excited as hell when I finally got my Yallerhorn to drop. Um, they made a big deal when Jure sold it. Because he only sold it, I think, twice when the game was first released. And then he went ahead and didn't sell it again until, I think, the week before the new light level cap. And the week before year two actually kicked off and the yellow horn was irrelevant. So it was one of those things where it, it was cool when you had it. Um, but then you weren't going to buy it. You had to wait for it to actually drop. And it was a son of a bitch to get to drop. So... I like that they're bringing it back. I hope they do something because I don't think the nerf to it at the end of year one was enough to go ahead and make it so um, it's not going to be the end all be all. Especially if they leave it the same as year one Yallerhorn. It's going to fucking destroy everything. Even though rockets aren't used that much in PvE for year two, you tend to favor machine guns. However, if I tell you I have a rocket that I just need to get close to the boss and then it tracks them with Wolfpack rounds that do shit tons of damage because you basically don't miss any of your damage from your rocket. It's a cluster bomb that doesn't miss for players who have never used it. Um, so, like I said, I, I'm excited that they're bringing it back. It's definitely an iconic thing and it fits perfectly with the DLC because the story behind the Yellow Horn was that it was forced out of the armor of the other fallen Iron Lords who fell during one of the major battles and Lord Saladin is the last Iron Lord around because he went ahead and survived that one battle and forged the Yellowhorn. So, it fits the DLC perfectly. I'm happy they're bringing it back. However, I really hope they go ahead and do some tweaks and changes to it and don't bring back Year One Yellowhorn. Please don't bring back Year One Yellowhorn Bungie. Um, it will absolutely destroy the community. So, Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. I want to know what you guys think about this topic. Are you excited for the Yallerhorn again? Or are you like me and you just never got it to drop until late into year one? Um, what do you guys think? Are you excited? Are you skeptical like I am? Um, are you upset? Are you angry? Let me know down in the comment section below. So thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, a comment, a favorite, and subscribe. And as always, I'll see you guys later. Peace.